Hi friends, I'm Wani and welcome to Wani's house. So, although I said I wouldn't be back until the new year, I realized there's one video that I did forget to record and that is my what I got for Christmas video. And so this is one that I do every year, show you guys um, what I um, got for Christmas. I'm just sharing with you, no bragging or anything, but just sharing. And the one complaint I heard from all of my um, my family members and my friends was like that, Wani, we don't know what to get you. What do you give a person that has everything? And I honestly understand that because a lot of the things I get now are from um, cooperation, sponsorships, and things like that. So things that I probably normally would have asked for, whatever, I, I don't need anyone to buy. But there were a couple of things that were on my list that um, were well, not necessarily on my list. They kind of figured out about what it would be that I would like based off of things that I probably have said in the past as well as things that I said that I wanted to do. So I want to say um, to all of my family and my friends, you guys did very well because honestly, I told them I didn't need anything. I really didn't want anything. I was like, I don't know what to tell you guys. There is nothing that I needed. And so um, I'm gonna show you guys the things that I have. There were a couple of things that I actually bought for myself. And they're, they're just little random things that I thought were cute and that I liked. So I put those in this haul also. So so go ahead. So go ahead, get you something to drink, whether you're watching this later in the evening, you're drinking a soda, drinking some water drinking some tea, girl, or it's after five and you got you a glass of wine or a little something, something to get you through the rest of the week. <sighs> Sit back and enjoy my, what I got from Christmas haul. Come on. Okay, so let me start with what my supervisor gave me for Christmas. And so um, last week, I think it was, we had our our staff lunch or whatever. And afterwards, my supervisor was like, I have something for you. And, um, and it was wrapped up in this beautiful paper. Wish I would have kept it. But anyway... And it, it was this box right here. So the, this box is one of the gift box boxes from Anthropology. And guys, I mean, it was, I was like, ooh. So I did not know if the contents were actually from Anthropology or if she just had the box. Well, guys, she knows me. She, I don't even know. I loved everything that was in the box. So the first thing that was in the box and it was beautifully everything was in here beautifully one thing is gone i'm gonna tell you about that in a minute so one item that i have is this beautiful like tiled and it's black and gold and white my colors um and it has an l on it i love this this is really cute um this will definitely be here on my desk um here at work i mean well here in my office when i'm working from home I will have it here and I have my coffee out of, I drink my coffee out of here. I love it. Now this is from, you guys can't see it, but it's from Anthropology. Love this. Now this is actually right now after Christmas because I'm um, recording this. It's like the 27th. It's after Christmas, y'all. It's on sale. So if you want to look this up, you can get it and see if they have your alphabet but really cute. I love this. This is so me. It's definitely something that I would definitely um, have chosen for myself. Love this and the coloring. The next item here um, is a candle. Um, I don't know where the candle's from. 
but it smells amazing. It smells so nice. And this is definitely one that I will definitely have over on my side table here when I'm reading. Sometimes I work over here when I don't want to be over at my desk. So, And I love burning candles. You guys see that? You guys see a lot of candles um, throughout my house. If you don't see real candles, you definitely see faux candles flickering. So I love the look of candles. I also love the scent of a very good candle as well. Then we have these here. These are Toddy Time Shower Steamers. You get a set of four in this. Very nice. And so the scents in here, I can't see it. Don't have my glasses with me. But you have four of these. And these are really nice once you, you um, wanting to like detox or, you know, just get over the day. One of the things I did a, a lot, especially when we first began to go back into the office was I would come home and take a bath um, and just like decompress. And a lot of times I still, I take a bath, but these are for the shower. So you just run your shower and when it gets hot or whatever, and then you place one of these in the corner as they the water hits it, it kind of just steams it. It gives you sort of like an aroma therapy in the shower effect. The aroma of these smells so good. And so I love this. It's a really cute little gift. And I absolutely love it. Now the other item that was in here, which was a big item in here, because this box is a, a, a large, a pretty good size box. The item that was in here were these slippers right here guys when i opened this box and i saw the slippers i was like oh my god they look so comfortable and so i took them out and i tried them on now i did this when poodle was here so we, this was everyone was here at the house we were opening the gifts and so i just opened up all of the gifts all at once because all the gifts, the one, the gifts from Mr. B to me, the gifts from me to Mr. B, from um, my my sister, from my dad, everything was just up under the tree. So usually what we would do, Mr. B and I would exchange our gifts, but because when we were wrapping gifts, we were just wrapping gifts. So we was like, I do not want to go through and be looking through all that stuff. So we just put everything up under the tree. This was one of the things. So when I opened up the gift, I loved the shoes. The, um, the slippers, I put them on. They are so comfortable. So comfortable. And I was like, oh my, these are really nice. Guess who heard me say that, y'all? Puda. So Puda, she was like, mom, let me try those on. And so I did. But then I gave them to her to try on. And I turned and looked in another direction or whatever. And I forgot about the shoes. So later on in the day, I go and I'm looking at my my gifts again because I bring them here in my office and I'm looking through them and I'm like where are my slippers and I look in the box it's not in the box y'all Puda borrowed my slippers she was like I didn't think you would realize they were gone I was like how would I not realize you like, mom you have a lot of slippers I say yes but those came from my supervisor and I love them so I'm gonna put the slippers right here so what I did y'all was Poodle's bringing me my slippers back, but these slippers right now are on sale. They are like a platform slipper. They're from Anthropology. They're on sale right now, I think for $23.95 or something like that. Y'all gonna wanna get these. They are so luxe and just very, very comfortable. So I ordered me um, another pair, and those are for Puda, so I can get the ones that my supervisor um, gifted me back. So, but she was like, "Mom, they are they are so so nice. They are." So, th I want to thank my supervisor. I don't know if she watches my channel, but I love them. So, I'm getting my slippers back this weekend. Puda's coming back over to bring me my stuff. Okay, so I have that. Then, speaking of Puda. Let me show you what she got me. So one thing that um, she picked up 
and it was from Pandora. I love Pandora. And it was actually this silver, sterling silver Pandora bracelet with the charms. So you know with Pandora, you have to buy the charms. Pandora, sometimes it can be a little pricey unless you catch a sale. And so um, this is the charm. I think it's a heart charm. Yes, it's a heart. It's like two hearts. I'm not sure if you guys can see it. It's very pretty. So I have this bracelet here from Pandora. And um, it came in, you know, in the Pandora box. And, you know, in the little the little box here and then the little um, dust bag. So I have that. Y'all know I love Alex and Annie. And um, speaking of those types of things, just like Pandora, sometimes for Alex and Annie, it can be um, a little pricey unless you catch a sale. So you guys have probably seen me wear my Alex and Annie bracelets. These are them. I have one for like my Zodiac. I have one that um has Puda got me says i love you one that has a heart with angels and so different things they have a lot of a couple of these like six or seven of these love these i have some that are gold um sterling silver some that are gold that i really like now one thing that i picked up for myself from alex and annie was the ch uh, the chain station and it's this necklace here it's um it goes from eight from 19 to 38 inch, inches. It's an expandable necklace. And I want you guys to see what this looks like. It is so pretty. You can double it. You can wear double strand, single strand. This is what that looks like. And it was on Alex and Annie's um site i don't remember how much i paid for this um but it is sterling silver so it will not change it is so pretty so very elegant and um dainty so we have that and so that is one gift that i purchased for myself because um i do love alex and annie and i gifted my girls, um, Alex and Annie bracelets. And so we all have the same Alex and Annie um, bracelet for this year. And um, so, and I decided to gift myself a necklace as well. Okay. So we have that. Also from Poodle, well, actually this is from Poodle's um, boyfriend, it's one fragrance that I, they kept asking me, you know, like, what do you want? What do you want? And I was just thinking around here, like, what do I, what have I ran out of? What do I want? And so I was um, doing something and I went to my favorite fragrance. This, this is Wild Poppy by Nest. I love this. And evidently everybody else has caught on to this fragrance because it could not be found. It was sold out. Um, all around me at all the Sephora's it was gone online you couldn't get it um, so it was all gone I went into Kohl's it, it was gone JCPenney it was gone in the in the Sephora's and so I told them I wanted this and they went looking for it and originally told me that it was sold out well guys I got it again I was I was like sad and I was, this is one of the things I was like, I'm just going to go buy it again myself. I'm a, I was going to dry, just have a little bit in there, just a corner. You guys see the corner? I was using this sparingly. I love this fragrance. Now, I found this fragrance um, when I was I was getting the, 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 the scent um, subscription from, can't think of the name of the, the script subscription now. But I got this. And I love it. Give you the little valve, like a little small um, valve, like that. And I used that all up. And then I ordered it again. And I was like, I am just gonna have to buy this. And so this bottle right here costs about like a hundred and five dollars. But guys, and if you guys got it on sale, and so far I think at the time they had like twenty or thirty percent off. So you can get it for like ninety something, eighty something dollars. 
<sighs> couldn't find it. So I was going to buy it myself since nobody else could find it. And, um, but I got it. So I got this and it's the same thing, the same size and everything. I almost jumped out of my skin because I knew that I was down to like nothing. So just that little corner is all I have left. So now I have another bottle and this actually lasted me about a year, probably a year and a half, maybe two years because you know, I have other scents that I like to wear, but this is definitely one of my favorite, um, I'm sorry, my favorite spring summer scents. Yeah, she loves this one. So I got this one. Now another scent that I said that I wanted and I was hoping that I was going to get was the, the, the Jador by Lancome. I use all that I have. I have just that much left. No more. And so I thought that I was going to get that. And I didn't. But what my sister did end up purchasing me was the Co um, Coach Floral Bliss um, Adu Parfum. And so I like this one too because, you know, I love sweet florally type scents and this one right here once again does not disappoint it smells so good it, and it is very floral then it has like a a very nice like soft um, dry down so nice so i have this and once again this is by coach and it's floral blush all right so we have that Whew. okay so another thing that my sister purchased me she was like girl i know you're not like that bling 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 type of girl you know she said but i you know i, I had to get you these because they are so darn comfortable and she's right I don't like the bling bling flashy flashy type things um but she bought me these these are cute though and she's right these are so comfortable very comfortable and um I like it, it does have an arch in there on the inside so they my, my flat feet feels so good in these this part right here, I was like, okay, I can do that. That's that's not that bad. Now, is this something that I normally would, would pick up on my own? Definitely not. It is not, but she's right. Th these are cute with the right um, outfit. I can probably see myself wearing them. And definitely be wearing these in the house, but these were really nice. So, I love these. And I'm really thankful for all of my gifts because I do know shopping for me can be um, difficult. Another gift that I picked up myself, I was out shopping for everyone else and I came across these right here and these were at TJ Maxx in the um, jewelry area and these are the um, some um, bodega dupes. Guys, these are so cute so cute and you can see they, they're gonna look really nice when i wear them so i picked me up some my mom some in silver and i picked up a pair from my sister and so yeah she loves those so that was a gift to myself and then if you saw the um the dream team's gift exchange video um, you guys would have seen this. Now, this headband, now I had it on for the video, but it's not actually for that. It's actually for when you put on your makeup and you want to pull your hair back. You put this on and you go ahead and you can do your makeup. It is a makeup headband. And it's just a little something, you know, if you're just a little bit extra like I can be, this is so cute. But I wore it for the video just because... I thought it went well with my pajamas that I had on. And this is something you you can, you know, you use at night, right? So cute. Love the rhinestones that's going through here. Love the blush pink color. And so I picked up one, this one for me, and I picked up a blue one, I believe, for Puda. Very cute. And this was at 
TJ Maxx also. And I think these were $5.99. Very nice um, to have, I believe. Okay. Something else that I received. One thing um, everyone knows about me is I typically don't buy sneakers. Mr. B typically buys my sneakers. I have never been like a real a sneaker girl. You know, um, I've always been one who wear boots, heels, um, pumps, stuff like that. Sneakers, you know, I would just have like my white girl tennis shoes or something like that. And so Mr. B has made it his thing to make sure I have more like active wear so that I can, you know, put on something really cute and quick and run out. So Puda was out and she was like, Mom, I think you need some more sneakers. Now, one thing that I plan on doing this, hopefully this week, as I need to get into my closet because this is a time, you know, we get rid of a lot of things. And um, I'm going to talk about that later, but we could, we get rid of a lot of things. And so I want to have everything purged and ready so that by this weekend, we can go ahead and take it on to the Goodwill for our end of year purge. We purge several times a year and usually the one at the end of the year is the biggest purge. So I'm getting rid of a lot of things. And some one thing that I'm getting rid of is probably some shoes if I haven't worn it or, you know, I'm, I'm just gonna get rid of them. A lot of times I have people say, why don't you go and put it on next door or do your Poshmark? I don't have time for that. You know, I, I don't have time for that. I'm always moving or whatever. So I, I'm just gonna do that. That being said, Puda bought me these shoes right here. Really cute. These are from Nautica. I know I'm going to wear these during the summer. With a cute Nautica, um, like, polo type shirt and probably some um, jean shorts or something like that. I was already putting my um, outfit together for when we go on one of our two trips for next year. So I do want to have these. So I have those from Puda. So she gave me, she got um, gifted me a pair of shoes and borrowed my sneak um, my slippers. Two figures. Then um speaking of sh more shoes, I Mr. B. No, it's not that. Bought me. Some more sneakers now these are like platforms and these are by from puma love the pink and the white love the platform these are so comfortable y'all very very comfortable great for the weekend i can see these with a blue jean skirt something like that very cute so this is what these look like okay we have that and he bought me that because picked up me some of the Puma um, t-shirts to go with that and then I have a white one and these are you know cute right now even up under like a sweatsuit or something like that and then I have this pink Puma hoodie that is like this real pretty um oh goodness it's not velvet i can't think of the name of this fabric but it's very very soft real pretty so this is definitely great weekend wear for me or when i have to go in the office on a friday and we're dressing down i can have those on and then um so i have that showed you the shoes and then I picked up these shoes right here because my mom gave us like, here, let me just give you money because you, you're too hard to shop for it. And when I, even when I tried to shop for myself, there was nothing that I, I saw that I wanted. So anyway, Mr. B and I went out and then I picked up these shoes. So this is going to be for my mom. And these um, were Puma also. They're like step-ins and then you have the time right here. These are so comfortable. Oh my gosh, these are comfortable. So I have these in this real pretty um, white color. I like the pink, the detail up here for the lacing. Very nice. So I picked up those. 
I know I'm moving a little fast right now because this video, I don't want it to be too long. And then from Puda, ah, I need to take this back. Um, I forgot about this. I have this faux leather brown skirt. And I need to take it back because it's a too big. It's a 2X. I needed a 1X in this. This is from Old Navy. So I need to take this back to exchange it. She also um, got me a brown um, turtleneck. It's very, very soft. Very soft. So I have that. And then she got me this top right here and I might need to try to try this on because she thinks she got a 2x she did and I need a 1x it might be too big I'm gonna have to try this on but it's supposed to hang off the shoulder so this is one thing I have not tried on that I need to try on and I need to um, take the skirt back so we'll see if the shirt will work okay have this. I have a lot of stuff over here. Then from Puda, because I was like, I need when they asked me about things that I needed, I wanted some faux leather brown um faux leather brown pants. Um I wanted that. I needed some black shoes that I could wear to work that was not like a heel heel. I need, because I do a lot of moving. So I need something that's comfortable. And so I need something I can wear with a dress. I can wear it with pants. So one thing Poodle got me but um, was the heels. But they were too narrow for my foot. So I took them back to JCPenney for, and, and, and exchanged them for these. Aren't these, this is definitely a one issue. This is so fashionable. It is, um, I think it's very um, versatile. I can wear it with a dress, with some tights. I can wear it with pants. And that heel, that block heel right there is what's going to save me. Love it. It's a faux croc. Very pretty. These are um, Liz Claiborne's. Love them. Okay, so we have that. Let's see. And then Puda, of course, gave me a lot of beauty things to take care of my skin. Like I have this hydrolonic acid here, so the moisture cream. Um, then um, she bought me, y'all know I love these. These are the um, makeup remover towels. Love those. I gave my girls um, these in their bags for my birthday um, spa day that we did this year. They had those. I, I, those are definitely a must-have for me. She bought me some wool socks here. Very cute by Born. And then, oh this top right here and it is actually a bodysuit and then you tie it up here this is so cute so cute and let me see what size does she get this did she get this in the right size i think it's a 1x so this should fit me just fine so i love this right here and how it's gonna have the bows right here really cute i can see these with jeans um i can see these with a skirt um, I can wear this now. Of course, I would have to wear a jacket, but I can also wear this later on um, in the year when the weather is warmer. So, I think that is everything that I have. I didn't show you guys. This is Black Snail, and this is a repair toner. She bought me this, and then I also have a collagen cream because she's all into like the school, the skin and preserving it and all that other stuff. So those are the items that I have. Ooh, I, I, I tell you, I am very, very blessed. I love all of my items. I'm actually, I was actually in the, um, in the bedroom and I was taking down the tree that's in the bedroom and I had um, some of the stuff in there and I was like, you know what? Right now, while I'm doing this, this will be the perfect time to share with my family members what I got for Christmas. 
and um <laughs> and to let you guys know that I'm officially a hard person to shop for not because I intend to be um purposely but simply because like I stated I get a lot of things and I request things that I like and the things that I like are things that I definitely think that you guys will like so I don't want to bring you no mess. So if I don't want it and why they don't like no mess. So if I don't want it, I don't have it. I definitely will not bring it to you and let you guys know about it. So that's it. That is all that I have to share with you guys. We're at 27 minutes and 51 seconds. And I think I have occupied um, enough of your time today. Um, I just wanted to make sure that I keep this going with what I got for Christmas. You guys typically like those types of um, videos. And I must tell you guys, I'm so happy the holidays, the Christmas is over. As much as I love it and um, I love like the, the just the everything about it, how the, the lights and everything, I hate taking down the ornaments and the trees. And this year, shopping for my family members, it was a little bit much for me. I'm like, because once again, like just like they did not know what I needed or wanted, I had no clue about what they needed or wanted either. So the feelings is mutual. So um, that's it, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, hi, I'm Wani, and welcome to Wani's house. If you like what you've seen, go ahead and hit that subscribe button as well as the notification bell so that you won't miss out on any of my upcoming uploads. You can also come on over and check, check me out on my Instagram. You can find me over there at Wani's house. Hit the follow button, then you will be in the know as to what is to come over here at Wani's house. One last thing. I want to thank you guys. I cannot, I'm coming back in the new year, but I want to thank you right now for 2023, okay? You guys have showed out for me and shown up for me in more ways than you know. Um, I was also trying to think about it. Last year, I think I put together a compilation video. I might do that. Like I said, I don't know if I can stay away from you guys too long because I keep coming up with things that I want to do or show you before the before the end of the year because it wouldn't make any sense for me to bring them to you in the beginning of the year, right? Anyway, thank you. I want to say thank you right now in 2023. Thank you for all of your support all of your encouraging words, always for showing up for your girl, always for participating. And this year we did a lot of different things. We're going to talk about them. I don't want to get into it here. We, we're we going to talk about them though. And, um, but I just want to say thank you for everything that, um, for everyone who came in and gave me a thumbs up, left me a message, whatever you did. I want to thank you because I definitely would not be here if it wasn't for you guys. All right, guys, we're not getting in. We're not going to be mushy. I'm going to go ahead and end this video. I am about to go. But before I do, you know what I always say. The next time you're in town, you can always stop by Winnie's house. And I'll see you in the next video. And now I can put all this stuff up. And get the bedroom back together before the mister gets home. I have ornaments everywhere. <laughs> Bye, y'all.